Hi guys, Big Z here from Yes2Chat. In today's video, I will show you a quick and easy solution when experiencing a compatibility issue while importing QuickTime movie video file into your Adobe Premiere Pro. This problem can be described as a picture pixelating. I experienced this issue not long ago when I was working on one of my YouTube videos. For these videos, I needed to record my Apple computer screen and import the QuickTime video movie file into my Adobe Premiere Pro timeline. This is not issue only of the Adobe Premiere Pro preview. This same issue with the picture pixelation also happens when you export your file. If you wonder how to record screen on your Apple laptop or desktop computer, check out my other videos. So let's go ahead and I will show you the solution for this issue. Okay, so we finished our screen recording. Let's locate the file and play the recorded video. As you can see, it's all looking perfectly fine. There are no issues with this QuickTime movie file whatsoever. The issue starts when we import this file into the Adobe Premiere Pro. Now, when we preview the file in the Adobe Premiere Pro, we can see that it actually does not display correctly. Looks like the file is not 100% compatible with Adobe Premiere Pro and the whole movie is pixelated. Well, luckily, there is a very easy fix to this issue without any extra software required. All you need to do is open the file in QuickTime Movie Player, click on File, scroll down to the Export As option and select the movie resolution you desire. After that, rename your file, choose the destination where you wish to save the new file and in the drop down menu at the very bottom of the window select greater compatibility h.264 then press save you will see another window with export progress and once the export process is finished you will locate your new file and import it back to your adobe premiere pro Now, when you look at the file again, it's all working perfectly fine. There is no pixelation anymore. And we are done. The issue is solved. And that's all guys. Please give me a like if you find the video helpful. And also please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content like this. See you next time.